Peers and Kings, and welcome back to another video. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is my second video I've ever did in my new dorm, and this video is going to be my dorm tour. I wanted to film this part on my camera, but I've been having some technical difficulties that's been ruining the vibe. So I have to do it on my phone. Yeah! Can a day. But anyway, guys, this is our dorm. It's called Psych. Y'all thought y'all was gonna know the name of our dorm. <laughs> I don't want y'all like the weird people to be finding us. Back to the video though. It's one of the newer dorms that was built on our campus as of like the last like four years. It's like new. Compared to our dorm last year, that was super old. It's been there since my older, older cousin. The bathrooms are much, much cleaner. We also have like private bathrooms too. Yeah, the one downfall I would say we have is the window. Even though this window is tall and it appears big compared to the room, our other room had the wall full of windows. We had like four windows across and it let a lot of light in and this room kind of looks darker especially because our beds are on top of our desk when i'm sitting at the desk sometimes it looks like a um, dark and it makes me not want to work but yeah this is just the dorm tour so i hope you guys enjoy it give it a big thumbs up and if you have any suggestions for things that we should add to our dorm let me know and um and i like this aesthetic of our room more than last year because it's more homey like all the plants and like the the vibe is just like homey so yeah, let's get into this dorm tour, booze. So me and Kennedy are right off the elevator, but we decided to do the same thing with our door, like a little get to know me. We had a whiteboard for people to write, but it fell off, so ignore that. But when you open the door, this is the overview of the room. I personally like that this room, we get higher ceilings, which makes the room appear much bigger. And also I like how the lights aren't in the ceiling, but they're more so on the side on the wall. So this is what our door looks like from the back. And then when you go to the left, my keys and my mask are there, easy to grab. And then there's my closet. I just took those little drawings I drew of people and put them on my door from last year. And I added them on stair leaf because those are my favorite leaves. And when you open the closet, ignore how unorganized it is. I promise it's organized. Those are just my jeans up there, my warm clothes, and then my dirty clothes. And then I put my shoes on the door again, just like last year. And then my bed is lofted. So under my bed, I put some aesthetic pieces of art along with a picture of me, monstera leaves, and some mini vinyls. Also have a cute chair with a little pillow from five below and that stool, which I had in my room at home. The rug also from five below and these are what the pictures just look up close because you guys know i love retro so that's what i was going for for my room this year then there's my desk which kind of mirrors last year i just added that white shelf from five below as well um and the plants but i just was going for the aesthetics i also have this shelf where it has my palettes in the top the second drawer has more cleaning supplies and the third drawer has my hair products I also have a ladder which I don't use so I decked it out with some vines just to make it look aesthetically cute because I generally am afraid of the ladder. But this is what my desk looks overview. This is where I spend 90% of time so I want to make sure it looks nice but up the top has just mask and other things that I use. And I also got these nice lights that you just stick on and they work well in the night. This is what my bed looks like at the top. I have the same bedding from last year. But as far as the wall, I went for aesthetic pictures. And then on the side of my bed, I have this cute plant hanger thing. And then this is where I get dressed in the morning. So the shelves have my healthcare products and all of that, my food, hair things, etc. This is what it looks like from afar. Our mirror was hanging, but it fell off the wall. So yeah, my parents are clutch for all the water. And then we, like I said, I have we have an in-wall unit for our air, so that's nice because we can control it ourselves. Then if you come over here, this is all of our food things. So we hung those records and also monster leaves there. And that's actually a bathroom shelf that we actually use to put our food on. So we have our toaster, a blender, you know, sandwich bags, bowls, napkins, and then our silverware, plates, all of that mask and hand sanitizer and then this is for my underwear and towels and then the bottom drawer is just anything miscellaneous that i didn't know where to put i just put down there then for our entertainment section i just use one of my shelves as our little like 
coffee shelf whatever so our tv is on the windowsill and then i put the rest of the vinyls there just to make it look cute that plant is from five below and then we have our wii video games board games anything that involves entertainment and then the bottom is for cleaning supplies this wall here is just a board and then we have this love lamp that also came from five below that we stuck on the wall and then vines just to fill the space of the ceiling since the ceilings are so high we got this tapestry from Amazon and it just completed the wall because there was nothing there. Then we have the garbage, recycling, and then our little workout section. This just has a dumbbell, so if whoever want to work out, I don't know who works out with eight pounds, but sure. And then a roller, a volleyball, and our yoga mats. I kept my trunk from last year, but I didn't know where to put it, so I put it right in front of that shelf. And then we have this rug that's really, really cute from Five Below. This is our view from outside of our window. We don't have a row full of windows like last year, but we do have a fairly big window. Um, unfortunately, we don't have much of a view because there's trees. But on the windowsill, I just have, you know, some artwork, cute things. And we also have LED lights, which you will see shortly. One thing I love about the room is my lights here on my bed. They give me like campfire vibes. <laughs> And then these are our LED lights at night. So we hung them around the ceiling of the room recently just because they were a little bit dark just around the base. But at first, originally, we just had them along the floorboards of the room. And now that they're on both, the room looks more lighter at night and more of a vibe. So yeah, that's our room. Well, thanks for watching my uh, dorm tour. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys have any suggestions for anything we should add to the room, let me know in the comments down below because I would love to know like what you guys think. Follow me on Instagram at CRX Andrea and follow my makeup Instagram at Makeup. I'm coming back with my makeup channel. Like I said, it's been hard because I'm trying to figure out my whole camera situation right now. It's not been working out for me since I've been here because I used to use my dad's computer. I'm still trying to figure that out. So subscribe to the channel, become a king or a queen. I'm trying to get back consistent on YouTube even though the views have been low. That doesn't matter. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace. Bye.